it is no surprise that there are a ton of people selling t-shirts on Etsy. And if you're trying to start selling t-shirts right now, you may feel like the entire space is oversaturated. However, there are several things you can do to break through the competition. And there's one way you can make your listing stand out above the rest of the competition. So I want to share with you exactly how to do that all coming up next. Welcome back to the video, my friends. You're new here. My name is Jay, and on this channel, I teach you how to make passive income online by creating and selling your own products. So if you like content like this, then consider subscribing to my channel. So the main resource we're gonna use for today's video is Placeit. Placeit is a great space for you to create, just not video mock-ups, but also all things print on demand in regards to different products, as well as creating designs right here in Placeit. Now, our case today, we're gonna to focus on creating video mockups, but just not for t-shirts, which is the popular thing. And then I know most people are creating, but they have video mockups for all print on demand products like hoodies, hats, mugs, tote bags, just to name a few. So if you wanna check out Placeit on your own, I make sure to leave all the details in my description box below, along with a discount code for you to see if this is best for your print on demand business. So here's Placeit. Again, they have a lot of different mockups you can use for your print on demand business. And so, yes, we're talking about video video mockups today but again they have all things mockups for everything like t-shirts they have mockups for tote bags hoodies hats and if you check out their options for you to actually create some mockups you can go to mockup area here and they have a dedicated space for print on demand so again you see all the options here coffee mugs drinkware and again this is good if you are looking to create something outside of t-shirts but still have a quality mock-up and again i specifically use it for their video mock-ups because right now it's a lot of competition in regards to t-shirts so you have to find a way to stand out yes using great keywords and tags are good but what are you going to do when people click on your listing or at least see your listing in search there has to be something different than the rest of the people there and there's just not a lot of people using video mock-ups so yes they have a lot of still images here they have a you know a wonderful technology that applies your t-shirt design right here on the image so again it makes it as if it is printed right on the t-shirt itself it goes with all the rinks and all the curves with the t-shirt so it makes it look like the t-shirt is actually printed out with your design so if we do want to check out video mock-ups again all we have to go up here to do is just go up to mock-ups go to print on demand you have some print things you want to do here you have the option as well uh, but in our case today we're just talking about print on demand and i have these things here Notice how as we are in this print on demand area, they have just t-shirts, but they do have a dedicated space for print on demand apparel. This is where you're gonna find just a little bit more details in regards to what type of mock-ups they offer with apparel. Again, we have face masks, hats, hoodies, leggings, ones that you can go through this list yourself. But just know that if you are trying to find specific clothing, you wanna to go to apparel. But if you wanna go with anything print on demand outside of apparel, like your coffee mugs, your bags, your drink, where's your phone cases, these are in this section here where they have print on demand. So from here, let's go and do some discovery. Let's see what type of video mock-ups um, place it has that we can actually compete in Etsy search and make our product stand out even more. Now, another way to search up video mock-ups, especially if you know what product you wanna go with, just go to the search bar here. And in our first case today, let's search up t-shirt video mock-ups. So we will put t-shirt. And as you can see, they're already all the populated some results for us. So we know we want to go to t-shirt mock-up video or t-shirt video. We can go with either one and we can see what type of results that we have. So you will see this little, you know, uh, upload your image here. Again, they have this technology for you just to upload your, your image and it will literally go on this specific model as if it is printed right on it. Now with these video mockups, in the case of our t-shirts, there's a couple different versions here. Some of these, you know, t-shirts have the horizontal ratio and uh, some of them have the landscape ratio. So just gotta figure out which one works best for you. I like to go with the one obviously that is horizontal because that fits most phones as most people are shopping on mobile with Etsy. But there are some things you can do in Etsy on the back end to make all things fit that particular ratio style. So we also have the video mock-up with the product and the model in the shot, just straight up video. But then we have these type of videos here. As I scroll down, that's just a shirt by itself. And again, just an easy way to showcase what your product is. Now, some of these mock-ups, we actually have it like this one here, just a picture, right? So there's a cycle of pictures happening to showcase your product in a, in a different way. Technically, it's still a video, but it is a snapshot video of your product. And third, if I can go down here and find an option, 
There we go. We have one here that we have literally text on screen. So there's some text we can put on here, to showcase our product. Again, I think this is more so geared towards any social media outlet you have. I think that's a great way to put this type of video there. But in regards to Etsy, I think it's just best to have the product in the shot and just have it in that video format to really attract the buyer who's coming to search up for items like yours. So we have three different versions here. We have a lot of options we can play with. Yes, we have some things that have two products in shot. We have the shirt as well as the mug. So you just got to go through this and see what type of product model you're looking for and what type of video work best with your overall product style. All right, so with one of our t-shirts, we can go up here and select one here. So we can go ahead and pick a t-shirt that I feel works well and showcase the shirt in its entirety. So we can go with this one here. And as you can see, we have a couple of options in regards to this video mock-up. We can insert our image here. Uh, we can add in some audio if we are playing some music. So right now, Etsy does not allow us to play audio. But again, if you're using this for social media, you can definitely add in some audio here uh, as it has a large selection of music to choose from. But again, in our case today, because we're using this primarily for our Etsy listing, we're going to keep the audio off. And we have the option here to, to change the shirt color here. And I love this because it changes this right on the spot so again if we're creating a t-shirt that has white text on it we can have a black t-shirt and everything will pop up well and vice versa if we have a t-shirt that has some black text on it and it does not work with the black shirt we can change it right here very quickly as you can see and still have a decent design now we do have some options here on the right hand side if you want to see some comparable video mock-ups that might fit well with what your overall first one is so again they, they just keep everything in front of you so you can have some options here to change and to fit what your overall design is. Now from here, we can insert our design, upload here from our device. All right, so now I have my image uploaded. And there's a couple of things I want us to note here. We have this little box and this little, you know, ant trail that's coming along the borders. This is showing us that anything with inside the highlighted area will be showcased on our shirt. But if we scoot over to the left or right, and it's not in the highlighted area, that will be cut off from our shirt. So we definitely want to make sure that whatever design we have is staying in the middle of our shirt. What I typically see work well with these designs here is that if you just move this over to the top of the image it seems to work perfect with the t-shirt here and if i think everything is lined up well i can just simply hit crop again i have the option here to zoom in and zoom out if i so choose but again i like to grab this myself and make some changes to fit my overall placement so again i think that is working well here and i can hit crop and what it will do is that it will literally paste this image here right on the t-shirt and it will create this into a video mock-up so again i have the white here say for some reason i don't like white i want to go to make this a black t-shirt again we have this option to change everything right on the spot and if everything looks good with the placement i can go ahead and hit play all slides and this will render out this design for me to allow me to have this video file i can upload on etsy all right so now we have our video all done i can go down to the bottom hit play and i can see exactly how this video is going to work on my Etsy listing. Again, I like this particular video here because again, it never moves the you know model out of the shot with the t-shirt flat. And again, just an overall great video to play because it keeps the design always in focus. So when people are scrolling on Etsy and see your product in search, at least they can see immediately the design and it's always in front of them. So if everything looks well here, I can go ahead and download this. And now I can take that file. And when I go to my Etsy listing, there's gonna be an option for me to upload this video file to showcase on my Etsy listing. So now that we have our video downloaded here, we have this option to download this to our computer. What it did here is it saved it to our account, but we definitely want to download this specific file to our computer so we can utilize this on our Etsy listing. All I have to do here is go over to the download area and click download. And now this will download to my computer for me to use this file on my Etsy listing. All right, so here we are in Etsy. And if you scroll all the way down past the photos, you have this option to upload video. Now, Etsy has already told us that we can bring to life our product with a five to 15 second video to drive more sales. And again, place it keeps with this criteria to make sure that the video does not go beyond 15 seconds. Now, they have a lot of quick tips here. The main focus here is just to make sure that our video is 1080p because it gives the highest quality. Again, place it fits with all those criteria. So if I wanna add my video here, I will just simply click add video, go to where my video is downloaded. And now I can upload this to my Etsy listing. And I can upload my file here. 
And as you can see, we have our video mockup being uploaded. All right, now we have our video mockup complete. I can go into here and just play the video back. And this is exactly what my, you know, uh, buyers are going to see when they hover over my listing in Etsy search. If I want to go in here and further crop the video, I have some options here to do that. And again, I can crop this video to make it more center in regards to the design. But I think with the overall uh, original size. I think it works perfectly here. I can play the video back here as well as just to check and see how this will look. So again, everything looks well. I can hit apply. I can finish my Etsy listing with my mock-up photos and of course with my titles and tags, but that's just how easy it is to add in video mock-ups to make your product stand out. Again, most people are not even using this. So again, when it comes down to creating an Etsy business print on demand, you got to stand out. And I truly believe just incorporating video mock-ups to every listing that you have. It's a great way for your product just to catch the eye of the shopper so that shopper can become a buyer and start clicking around on your shop. So video mock-ups is a great thing to add to your overall Etsy listing. And they also have options for you to create a video mock-up for a mug. So same process here. We can go and find one that fits overall style. We can upload our design here and have a video mock-up for our mug design. We can showcase on Etsy. And same process as we did before, we can go in and upload our image from our folder. We have our image here, which is the mama design that we're still using for this particular print on demand product. And it would do the loading of the preview here. And again, if I want to change the color of the mug, I can do that here as well. And again, I have the same options for me to add audio and as well to hit play for me to download and use on my Etsy listing. So here we have an option to create a, a video mockup for our hoodie. And again, we can just add one to our design, upload it here. Same thing we're going to do is grab that mom on design, which again is versatile for every product we have utilized today. And again, if I want to change the color of this design here, same options here, I can make this to be black. And if everything renders out well, I can hit play on slides and then I will have that option to download this one as well. And finally, if I want to create a tote bag with this design, I can go ahead and go to this option here with this video mockup. Go to upload my image, grab that same mama design. And again, here you will see that that design will be placed on our mock up here. And now I can hit all slides. And I can play this back and download this to my Etsy listing as well. So as you can see here, that video mock up worked out well for our design. Again, this is what people will see in Etsy search that will really showcase what our design is all about. And the same process we use to upload our t-shirt video mock-up is the same thing we would do to upload our video mock-up to this particular product. Now in today's video, I didn't have time to talk about how to actually go about creating a Etsy listing to get your product sold online. However, if you want to learn my step-by-step -step process of starting an Etsy shop, check out my next video here. And if you want to learn more about how to make passive income online, make sure you subscribe to my channel here. So always my friends, my name is Jay. And I will see you in the next video.